Hey, what's going on everyone? Thanks for joining us. So let's see what we can do. Have we got another Nilfgaard on the go? Ooh, Precision Strike. This is a tough deck. I know that they've lost the uh, Novigradian Justice. So it's all uh, Scoia'tael, but it's still a really good deck. So what do we want? I think we keep Lugos here. That's quite a nice bunch of cards there. Let's get rid of Scoia'tael. Can search for anything with that. I think getting rid of a few things with that's going to be quite nice. And do we want both of these guys as an engine? That's the question. I think we probably do. Lugos can get some nice damage on the go. And the Hunter. I think I'm pretty happy with this. Let's get rid of one of these. Yeah, that's great. Okay. Let's go ahead and get the protector down. Yes, what we are. Yeah, let's get the protector down. I'm not going to use my crystal skull. Let's see if our opponent's got any removal. Ah, okay. Our opponent's going to be using bombs. That's fine. But no Madoc. So. Let's go ahead. Play another one. I'll give that a boost. Keep him safe. And let's see. We're not going to be able to interact with much from our opponent here, to be honest. So it's going to be a tough one. Damage unit by eight. That is crazy. Okay. So we're not going to be having any fun today. Let's go with that. Another bomb. Yeah, unitless decks are absolute pain at the moment. They really are tough to fight against. Another one. Okay. And let's go ahead, play our hunter. It's a good thing we've got a decent selection of bronzes there. Our opponent's got something else, I would assume. <laughs> oh, that helpless feeling. Okay. Great. Yeah, we'll take that. And who have we got here? So I guess really the question is, I think we do want to keep Ceres because I would love to put the huge amount of pressure onto our opponent. Uh, Bear Witcher, probably not. Morkvarg, I'm not too sure. But I think Ceres is going to be quite nice. It really does force our opponent to smash some stuff out of his hand. Um, so yeah, that's that's going to be an interesting one. The long ship, I'm not too sure about. Kelmar, okay. That's fair. And we've got a five in the bin to use as well there, so. Um let's go with. Hmm. Yeah, I think we just start off with Ceres. Great stuff. And let's see what our opponent does. I am worried about Madoc putting a, uh, a debuff on this row here, but let's see what our opponent has. They're obviously going to have to do quite a lot to catch up. Yep, that's fine. Boost something in hand. That's cool. That's no issue. Playing a raid card. So, I think at this point... Let's see... More than likely, what kind of raid cards do we have? We've got a few ships. <laughs> we haven't really got anything to target our opponent with, so you know what? We're just going to play the Bear Witcher down. For some stats. Let's see how we go. Opponent's got another one, maybe? Alright, okay. A Forest Protector. If our opponent is buffing a unit in hand, it's nice that we have the Morkvarg ready. 
Okay, now we can start targeting our opponent with some stuff. So I think what I'd like to do is... Just clean up our deck a little bit. So we'll do that. We'll have a ship at the back. And we'll go ahead, deal the damage. That feels pretty good. And as I say, we're not really too worried at this juncture. It's a crazy deck our opponent's playing, though. I've not seen any other bombs or stuff. Probably kills... Oh, no. All right. Our opponent gives that a buff there. Let's see. What do I really want to play here? Yeah, we can probably just get rid of that. It's not optimal, but, you know... Could be useful. We're obviously already on a win here. Okay. And let's see. What kind of warrior do we want to grab? I think it's going to be worth grabbing a warrior. I know he's on that for another two turns. Um, or do we just put down Blue Boy? No, I think I want to wait with Blue Boy at the moment. I know we're giving up a couple of damage here, but I think just having a proactive play in the shape of maybe a Raiders or something would be nice. Um, yeah. Just in case we do go to a last round, I, I do want to make sure that Harold is still there and doing the good work that he does. Yeah, let's Blood Eagle. Go ahead, grab a Raiders. Take those guys in the back. We're still at a decent rate here. Like I said, the goal was really to put as much pressure on our opponent as possible. But that could go against me, I don't know. Destroy the unit with the highest base power, okay. That's fine. Ten. Is our opponent going to have ten? I'm going to put Blue Boy down. Really risky. But our opponent has to do something, right? Cool. So we missed out on two damage there. That's fine. It's by the by. That was maybe not the greatest idea from our opponent. Remove immunity. Okay. Can it be manually targeted? That's fine. I don't think we're particularly worried about that. Nice. Pass there. Oh, we need to play a card. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Needs to be manually targeted. You know what? I think at this point we probably do play Harold. We'll get ourselves a protector. Probably should have done that first, actually. That was a bit of a crazy move. Wasn't very smart. Could have had another two, three points of damage, but we should be okay. Let's see what our opponent does. If they've got some more removal, then let's see what they've got. Ooh. That is a big Sheldon Skaggs. Let's do this.
Yeah, pretty smart play from our opponent. Opponent's going to play Justice. So that's another eight. We're the best regiment in the whole foreign north. It's going to be a tough round for the final round. Do we just pass here? In fact, we're not doing too bad. Nice. And then... Oh, we go on ahead. And we can get rid of one of these to deal the most possible damage to something, which is that. And our opponent might well have eight, but let's see. Nice. Okay, so they have to play as Harold. Perfectly fine. So they have got one above us. We've also used our ability, which is a bit of a worry. But hopefully we've got enough cards in the deck that will uh, keep us going. So, yeah, let's let's see how this goes. Scourge is going to be good. That's a nice card to have. Ideally, I'd really want my totem. Totem, totem, totem! No. Okay. So I think the first thing that we want to do is play this down. Let's see how much our opponent does have. This is going to have to be the next card. Could have possibly saved that actually, that might have been a smarter idea, didn't realise he was going to have a, a minus, so that gives him plus two, okay, yeah. Uh, yep, 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 this is a tough one for us. So what's going to give us the most benefit, so that's four, takes it down to eight. So let's go ahead. I've done all that I can. Has our opponent got something big? He goes minus four for plus four, seven, seven. <laughs> We're absolutely equal. <laughs> what a crazy game. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure I could have had one point somewhere. Well played from our opponent. That was such a cool game. Um, it's tough. Tough deck to play against, actually. Tough deck. So thanks a lot for watching, everyone. I really appreciate it. And hopefully catch you in the next one where uh, instead of a draw, we'll get a win.